Well, here we have the uh, surplus power supply I picked up for it. It has got the right style of connectors. Uh, of course, power connectors for floppier hard drive. It's a 200 watt. Correct style of switch here on it for the, for the era. I don't know if this is an actual IBM supply or from a clone. I opened it up. It was surprisingly clean inside. The capacitors physically looked okay. There may have been a bit of one of you know, just starting to bulge. It was hard to say. Uh, I don't know if this is a supply that requires load to power up or if it'll come up without load. But uh, I'm going to power it up, take a look at the output voltages, uh, and see if it'll come up without load. Well, let's give it a shot. Fan didn't come up. I did see the lights flicker when I kicked it up. It may require a power good signal of some kind. I just don't know. Uh, it may also require load to actually kick over and start. I wouldn't be surprised. Or it may be that the fan's dead. Yeah, there's... Hmm. The voltage is dancing around. Uh, maybe it's trying to start and kicking off. Or maybe it's actually dead. Well, don't honestly know. I guess the next step is to just leap of faith, get the chips on the board. And see what happens.